Not that I need to see the calm, it's that I need to believe that he's good. Amen? Amen? I need to believe. I need to believe that I have power over sin. Sin don't have to have the best of me. All right. And when I say sin, is troubles, situations, things that tempt us to do wrong. Amen? Amen. So this is what the Lord tells me. He says, you can rule over it, but now, you got to realize something. If you don't, if you don't, that sin that was lying at the door is going to take over you. When the wrong comes in your life, when things start happening in your life, the first thing you want to do is separate yourself from the one that can save you. Amen! Don't look at me, Grace. It's the first thing that happens. All right. Amen. That simply means sin is taking over. What do you mean, preacher? I'm not doing anything. You said that right. <laughs> <laughs> You're not doing anything of the Lord. You're not pleasing the Lord at all. Your fear is that you don't act out of character. Your fear is that you don't get angry and do something to somebody. Your fear is that you have more concern about you and those around you than you do of the Lord. Amen. What is your biggest fear? Amen. Your biggest fear should be the Lord. Your biggest fear should be that the Lord is looking at you and trying to understand why you are allowing the things that's around you to move you in a pathway of unrighteousness when I have died on Calvary for your righteousness. Amen. Somebody else, somebody else. Amen. Amen. It's your heart to preach to you Because I'm going to tell you right now, the Lord is concerned about a lot of people who are allowing sin to reign. Amen. Amen. Allowing sin to reign. And sin comes in so many factions. I'm going to tell you, this pandemic brought a lot of sin in. Yeah. Church doors started to close. Sin started to reign. Shouting, hallelujah, hey, I got them now. Because they ain't going to be gathered together. Because the Lord said, oh, how good and how pleasant it is for brothers to dwell together. Boy, as soon as the pandemic helped, pew, church doors closed. And then you try to open them again, and you can't get half the church food. All right, all right. No. And it's hard for those who come because they start focusing on the empty seat. And they start wondering, why am I here? All right. If they not here. Sin is working, y'all. Sin is moving. Oh, Lord. And you know what? Wearing the mask is not going to stop it from spreading. Hello, oh, <laughs> somebody. Getting the uh, vaccine is not going to stop it from spreading. Amen. Amen. But living for the Lord will stop it from spreading. See, my brothers and sisters, this is a dangerous sign. This I'm well aware of. This used to beat me. Amen. When I would wake up in the morning and say I ain't going to church, Amen. it wasn't about going to church. It was that I wasn't going to hear any knowledge. I wasn't going to learn anything about the Lord. That's the danger sign. Amen. And one of the danger signs that we need to understand is that you don't know how to fellowship with other Christians. Because you now fellowship with your couch, fellowship with your TV, fellowship with your phone. You, amen. 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 You fellowship with everything else except with God's children. And he wants us to learn how to what? Fellowship. Fellowship. Seeing the crept in and put it in our mind. I, I, I can do church right here. I ain't got to go. I ain't got to get dressed. I, I don't feel like getting up this morning. I don't feel like, oh, Lord, I have to get these kids ready too. 
No, I'm just going to turn on this phone and sit back. Don't tell me sin is not creeping in. Amen. Oh, Amen. Those of you in Facebook, yeah, if you're on your job, you work it though. That's understandable. But some of us realize that we have given up on working to get in. Amen. Amen. Oh, Lord, have mercy, have mercy. We've given up. Have mercy. It's an easy task. You know, I wish I could just preach from my easy chair. <laughs> but my recliner, I can have it. And we're all in I can get it. <laughs> all right, all right. I got that down. But when I believe that I'm getting what I do because of what I'm doing, now I start to think more of myself than I want to be. Mm -hmm. Every time we go against the word, it says two or three gathered together in my name, he shall be in the midst. Amen. People tell me all the time, I don't need nobody else. I can just sit there and study on my own. Where is this? Where is this coming from? If you're moved to support this ministry, you can do so through Cash App at dollar sign Living Witness MC or through Tithely on our website at livingwitnessmissionarychurch.com. Click on the gift in the top right corner of the homepage. Thank you for watching and God bless.